Nestled in the heart of the Netherlands, there exists a testament to human ingenuity and engineering prowess. This is the IR. DF Woedegemaal, the world's largest steam pumping station, still operational today. Built in 1920, this marvel stands as a proud symbol of the Netherlands' battle against the relentless waters. The Woedegemaal is a vital cog in the intricate system of dikes and canals that keep the Netherlands dry. It represents the culmination of generations of knowledge and the unwavering spirit of Dutch hydraulic engineering. Stepping into the engine room of the Woedegemaal is like stepping back in time. The air hums with the rhythmic churning of massive steam engines, their polished brass gleaming. These colossal engines, powered by coal-fired boilers, drive eight enormous pumps, capable of displacing a staggering 40,000 cubic meters of water per minute. The Woedegemaal is not just a museum piece, it is a living testament to the power of human ingenuity. This is a place where history comes alive, where the echoes of the Industrial Revolution reverberate through every pipe and valve. To truly understand the significance of the IR, D.F. Woedegemaal, we must delve into the Netherlands' extraordinary relationship with water. For centuries, the Dutch have lived in a delicate balance with the North Sea, reclaiming land, building dikes, and constantly innovating. The province of Friesland, where the Woedegemaal stands, exemplifies this struggle. This region, a patchwork of fertile fields and picturesque canals, was once a watery expanse, prone to devastating floods. The Zuiderzee, a shallow inland sea, held sway over much of the land, its unpredictable nature a constant threat. The story of the Netherlands is inextricably linked to its mastery of water management. Over generations, the Dutch honed their skills, developing windmills, canals and ingenious pumping systems. These windmills played a crucial role in draining the land, their vast sails harnessing the power of the wind to drive Archimedes' screw pumps. As the population grew and technology advanced, the need for more powerful pumping solutions became apparent. The Industrial Revolution ushered in an era of steam power, and with it, a new chapter in the Netherlands' battle against the water. The early 20th century marked a turning point. The Dutch government embarked on an ambitious project, the drainage of the Zuiderzee. This endeavor aimed to create new land for agriculture and reduce the risk of flooding. The answer lay in the construction of a pumping station of unprecedented scale and power, the IR, D.F. Woedagemaal. Named after the visionary engineer IR, D.F. Wooder, its mission was to pump vast quantities of water from Friesland into the Zuiderzee. The station became a beacon of hope, a testament to the indomitable spirit of the Dutch people. To fully grasp the engineering marvel that is the IR. D.F. Woedegemaal, imagine stepping inside its cavernous engine room. The air hangs heavy with the scent of coal smoke and hot oil, a symphony of rhythmic clanks and hisses filling the vast space. Towering above you are the steam engines, Behemoths of iron and steel, their polished brass fittings gleaming. Four massive boilers, fueled by coal, generate the steam that drives the station's heart. The steam races through a network of pipes, its immense power harnessed by the colossal steam engines. Each hiss of escaping steam, each groan of metal speaks of the immense forces at play within this cathedral of engineering. The true magic of the Woedegemaal lies in its pumps. Connected to the steam engines by massive crankshafts, these eight centrifugal pumps are the beating heart of this engineering giant. Each pump is capable of moving an astonishing 5,000 cubic meters of water per minute. The pumps draw water from the lower-lying areas of Friesland, lifting it through a system of canals and sluices. This constant flow ensures that Friesland remains dry, its fertile land protected from the encroaching waters. What makes the Woedegemaal truly remarkable is not just its scale, but its precision and efficiency. The entire operation, from the feeding of coal into the boilers to the regulation of steam pressure, 
is a delicate balancing act. In the control room, a symphony of gauges, levers and dials provides a constant stream of information. Skilled operators make minute adjustments to maintain optimal performance. Even today, the Wuda Jamal continues to operate with remarkable efficiency, a testament to the enduring quality of its construction. The year is 1998. Delegates from around the globe gather, their attention drawn to a rather unusual candidate for UNESCO World Heritage status. It is not a grand palace, but the IR, DF Wudajamal. This, the world's largest steam pumping station, stands as a proud sentinel against the relentless waters. The UNESCO committee recognized something truly exceptional within the Wudajamal's walls. It embodies a pivotal moment in human history the dawn of the Industrial Revolution and its transformative impact on society. The UNESCO designation recognizes the Wudagamal as a symbol of the Netherlands' indomitable spirit. It stands as a testament to the ingenuity and resilience of the Dutch people. The Wudagamal embodies the spirit of the, the Dutch word for a low-lying tract of land reclaimed from the sea. It represents the triumph of human ingenuity over nature, a testament to the power of collective action. The Wuda Gamal whispers tales of perseverance, innovation, and a deep respect for the delicate balance between humanity and nature. The UNESCO inscription is not just an accolade, it is a call to action. The Wuda Gamal, meticulously maintained and still operational today, serves as a beacon for future generations. Within its walls, visitors can witness firsthand the marvels of 1920s engineering. The Wudagimal serves as a living museum, educating and inspiring visitors of all ages. It is a reminder that even in our modern age, the echoes of the past can continue to inspire and guide us towards a more sustainable future. The IR DF Wudagamal, despite its imposing size, is a place full of intriguing stories. One tale speaks of the station's early days, when the massive steam engines were started using compressed air. Another story tells of a time when the station was threatened by a severe coal shortage in 1947. Local farmers, remembering the station's vital role, came to the rescue with peat, ensuring its continued operation. The Wuda Gamal's walls have borne witness to the ingenuity and resilience of the Dutch people. These stories add a layer of human warmth to the cold steel and rhythmic clanking of machinery. The IR DF Wuda Gamal has long been a source of immense pride for the Netherlands. Its status as a national treasure was cemented in 1952 when Queen Juliana visited the station. The Queen, known for her deep connection to her people, was eager to witness the marvels of this engineering giant. The station was meticulously prepared for her arrival, and workers lined the walkways. The Queen's visit, widely covered by the press, solidified the Wudagamal's place in the heart of the nation. The Wudagimal had received the ultimate seal of approval, becoming a cherished part of the nation's cultural heritage. The IR, DF Wudagimal, a marvel of early 20th century engineering, stands today as a testament to the enduring power of human ingenuity. But its continued operation, its rhythmic chugging a reassuring symphony for the people of Friesland is not merely a matter of historical preservation. It is a testament to the dedication and expertise of the men and women who have served as its guardians throughout the decades. These are the inheritors of a proud tradition, the keepers of a legacy passed down through generations. They are the engineers who understand the intricate workings of the steam engines, who can trace the flow of steam through a labyrinthine network of pipes and who can diagnose a problem with a practiced ear and a keen eye. They are the mechanics who keep the massive pumps running smoothly, who can dismantle and reassemble a valve gear with the precision of a watchmaker and who take pride in ensuring that every nut and bolt is tightened to perfection. They are the electricians who keep the lights burning and the control panels humming, the welders who repair the wear and tear of time 
and the cleaners who ensure that the station shines, its brass gleaming and its floors spotless. They are the storytellers, the ones who share the Wudagamal's history with visitors, who can recount the tales of engineering triumphs and near disasters, and who keep the memory of the station's past alive for future generations. These men and women, the guardians of time and tide, are the unsung heroes of the Wudagamal. Their dedication ensures that this remarkable feat of engineering continues to inspire awe and wonder, a testament to the enduring power of human ingenuity and the importance of preserving our industrial heritage. They are the living link between the past and the future, ensuring that the Wudagamal's legacy lives on. In our age of digital marvels and rapid technological advancements, it's easy to overlook the significance of a centuries-old steam-pumping station, yet the IR. DF Wudagamal, with its rhythmic churning of engines and the steady flow of water through its canals, holds a message more relevant today than ever before. It speaks of a time when human ingenuity was pitted against the raw power of nature and emerged triumphant. The Wudagamal stands as a potent symbol of sustainable development, a concept that has gained paramount importance in our era of climate change and rising sea levels. The station's very existence is a testament to the power of long-term thinking, of investing in infrastructure that can withstand the test of time and serve the needs of generations to come. Its story reminds us that true progress lies not just in embracing the new, but also in understanding and respecting the lessons of the past. The ingenuity of the Wudagamal's design, its ability to harness the power of steam to protect an entire region from flooding, serves as an inspiration for engineers and policymakers grappling with the challenges of a changing world. The Wudagamal, though a product of a bygone era, offers valuable insights into our own relationship with the natural world. It reminds us that we are not merely passive inhabitants of this planet, but active shapers of our own destiny. It is a testament to the power of human ingenuity to overcome seemingly insurmountable challenges and to create a more sustainable future for all. The IR DF Wudigamal stands as a testament to the power of collective action, a reminder that even the most daunting challenges can be overcome when people work together towards a common goal. In an increasingly interconnected world, where the consequences of climate change and environmental degradation know no borders, the spirit of collaboration embodied by the Wuda Gamal is more relevant than ever before. The station's story is a potent reminder that the solutions to our most pressing global challenges lie not in isolationism or self-interest, but in embracing our shared humanity and working together to build a more sustainable and equitable future for all. The Wudagamal, with its enduring legacy of innovation and resilience, can serve as a beacon of hope and inspiration for a world facing unprecedented environmental challenges. It reminds us that we are not simply inheritors of a fragile planet, but custodians of its future. Just as the engineers and workers of the past labored tirelessly to protect their land from the encroaching waters, so too must we embrace the responsibility to safeguard our planet for generations to come. The Wudagamal's legacy is a call to action, an invitation to embrace the spirit of innovation and collaboration that led to its creation. It beckons us to view the challenges of our time not as insurmountable obstacles, but as opportunities to forge a more sustainable and equitable future for all. It is a reminder that the heroes of our time are not just the inventors and innovators, but also the countless individuals around the world who are working tirelessly to create a more just and sustainable world. The IR. DF Wudagamal stands today as a testament to the enduring power of human ingenuity, a beacon from a bygone era that continues to inspire awe and wonder. It is a place where the rhythmic churning of steam engines blends with the gentle flow of water, creating a symphony of sound and motion that speaks to the heart of Dutch identity. More than just a museum piece, it is a living, breathing testament to the enduring legacy of the Industrial Revolution and its transformative impact on the world. The Wuda Gamal reminds us that progress is not solely about embracing the new, but also about understanding and respecting the lessons of the past. 
Its story is a powerful reminder of the delicate balance between humanity and nature, and the importance of sustainable development in a world facing unprecedented environmental challenges. As we stand on the cusp of an uncertain future, the IR, DF Wudagamal, with its enduring legacy of innovation and resilience, serves as a beacon of hope, reminding us that even the most daunting challenges can be overcome when we dare to dream big and work together towards a common goal. It is a testament to the power of human ingenuity to shape a better future for generations to come.